Hi, I am Siddhan, CEO and co-founder at Video Cipher. So this is the background story on how Video Cipher was initially thought and started by me and my co-founder and friend and batchmate uh, Vibhav while we were in IIT Delhi College. So this dates back to 2014. So we were students, engineering students in IIT Delhi. Uh, and uh, me and we were actually college mates and batch mates. So the problem of piracy was very obvious to us uh, because a lot of students around us were actually pirating uh, movies, they were pirating courses, they were pirating ebooks, and they were also pirating sometimes uh, like printed books. So the problem was very obvious to us. And also we had a, a friend and a batch mate, so he was also my roommate, Satish, who was always into chemistry teaching. So on his weekends, Satish used to go to different cities to teach chemistry to class plus one and plus two who were preparing for their medical or engineering entrance exams. And Satish was somebody who was like, like he only wanted to be a teacher and particularly chemistry teacher and he didn't want to even sit for campus placements. And even, so he used to go to even very far cities on weekends to teach chemistry. So Satish was very wary of his like notes and premium content getting leaked. So he was delivering only offline education, but he had prepared notes while he was himself studying during his school days uh, in organic chemistry, organic chemistry. And he had improvised over those notes. And so he was always very that if his notes and whatever he was teaching in classes, if it gets leaked, uh, then he will not get his fair share of student subscribers. And particularly in the cities where he was popular, so he will lose out on a lot of students and revenues. For this particular reason also, he was not uh, he was not willing to put his uh, best content online or he was even trying to go teach online. So again, the problem became more obvious for us. At this time, like Vibhav, who was again my batchmate and hostel mate, so he was all already into software-based development and he was doing cloud-based solutions for a few businesses as a freelancer. So he at the same time, coincidentally, he was doing a course on Coursera on related to encryption. So he thought of why not combine encryption along with the cloud-based video playback technology. At that time, I joined him to uh, kind of initially test out the product and uh, reach out to potential customers if there was a need for this and exactly build the product and business around it. So we built an initial beta or prototype and we tried approaching few potential uh, customers primarily in the North India region because we were ourselves based out of Delhi. So at that time, a particular finance-based community plus sports platform who were selling finance-based courses, they said that yes, uh, this was a problem and they wanted a solution around it. So we built out the like full product, usable product, and we eventually launched our first customer in September 2014 while we were still in college. So we actually had a five-year dual degree. Uh, and that is why we were there from 2010 to 15. And then we did online marketing, further sales, reached out to customers in India, outside India, we did online marketing and we grew in our customer base. Our second customer was uh, like, like an e-learning platform from UK. In July 2015, we graduated from our college and we also had one of our friend and batchmate Vikas joining us as our first co-founding employee. And like we, even before we got funding, and we started building more around the product along with him. Like we already had six paying customers and one lakh of monthly revenue by the time we graduated. But we couldn't get our angel funding at that time uh, like very quickly. So it was not uh, like a lucrative time like now where we had crores and crores of funding. So we were initially just looking for 50 lakh to 70 lakh of rupees and it took us quite a while and we eventually got the funding in April 2016. So we continued our journey in building out more secure product, uh, like a better playback and reaching out to customers all across the world. As of now, we are a team of 36 and we have 3000 plus uh, business customers all across the world in the e-learning and media field. And more importantly, uh, like Satish had to actually bring in his online and offline game together while uh, COVID stuck and still he continues the hybrid model. And for the online video delivery part, he still uses Video Cypher. So I'm happy that uh, like we could contribute to Satish's journey as a teacher and a content creator. And at the same time, we are able to contribute to over 3000 plus uh, education businesses. And it would be around uh, 10,000 plus educators. And uh, we are able to uh, uh, contribute to their journey. So the video online video piracy, it is not actually detrimental only to like success of the teacher, but also for the students. Many of the teachers 
like they have said that they were not willing to put their best content online because of the fear of the piracy so this was always a thing which many of the teachers told us so students also don't get to enjoy the best in class of quality of the content and that is where because of the video piracy students will also lose lose, lose out if uh, particularly in india and in developing countries best of the teachers they don't come online and start teaching online so it is time to teach and uh, uh, we are happy that we could help in journey of many teachers and uh, teaching based business platforms in spreading effective education to the students and at the same time delivering a viewing experience to the students in entire two three cities of india asia africa and uh, even many other uh, continents so that they can have the best learning experience thank you